and you make a cladogram using this table. Each X in the table represents that species having that trait. I like to start out cladograms by looking at what trait all of the species have in common. This is otherwise known as the ancestral trait. And as you can see, all of the organisms have legs. So I'm gonna draw my line to start out my cladogram. I'm gonna place the adaptation of legs here, and then I'm gonna make a V. This is showing a speciation event. If we look at our table, the lizard is the only species that only has legs. So what I'm gonna do is I'm gonna place the lizard at the top here because it only has legs. If we look at the next adaptation to evolve, fur evolves because rabbits and dogs both have fur. But remember, lizards don't. So fur goes here because it's not on the same lineage path as the lizard. And we're gonna place another line here and place rabbit at the top since rabbits have legs and fur. Next, I'm gonna look for the last adaptation to evolve and that's being a carnivore. So if we look here, we're gonna place the carnivore right here because the dog is the only one that's going to be a carnivore. So we place the dog all the way up here to the right. And if we look and check our work, the lizard has legs, the rabbit has legs and fur while the dog has legs, fur, and is a carnivore.